Tech students do get out to win big. Today we got a regular cat fight for everybody because we're pitting the Delta 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 sorority against the Alpha Beta Kappa Phi sorority. What? Now here on the Deltas we have the lovely Christine. No. The lovely Clayton. Yep. Um. Now you girls are in fact playing for a charity, aren't you? Yep, the Orange County's Animal Shelter. Yeah. I'm sure they can greatly appreciate the help, huh? Yes, definitely. Well, why don't you introduce me to your fellow sisters? Okay, this is Erin, this is Crystal, and this is Leigh Green. And it's nice to have all of you. Now, here on the Alpha Kappa Delta Phi sorority, we also have the lovely Christine. Hi. How are you doing today? I'm well, how about you? I'm doing fine. Can you introduce me to your sisters? Of course. This is Donna, Annalisa, and Alexis. Well, it's real nice to have all of you too. Now, are you guys ready to play the feud? Yes. Yes. We are. Definitely. Okay. So for first face off on the clay sheet and Christine. Now, you both know how to play. We survived. We surveyed a hundred students from UCI. The top seven answers are on the board. First one to buzz in gets the answer. Are you ready? Yep. Name the worst place to be caught naked. In the backyard. Uh, no, I'm sorry, it's not on the board. Christine? Church. Church? Uh, is church on the board? No, that's not on the board either. So, since Clay, she was the one who buzzed in first, we'll have to give it to her. Uh, would you like to pass or play? Play, play, play. play. All right. Okay, Clay, she now remember that the question is, what is the worst place to be caught naked? I would say the locker room. Good. Locker room. It's a pretty good answer. Is it on the board? No, I'm sorry, but it's not on the board either. Next time. Uh, Aaron, is it? Mm -hmm. Now, the question is, what is the worst place to be caught naked? Um, outside your house. See if that's yeah. on the board. Good one. Uh, it's not on the board either. So let's go over to your friend Crystal then. Crystal? What is the worst place to be caught naked? Um, I'm going to have to say your dorm. Mm, your dorm is actually a pretty good answer. It's probably going to be on there. Let's see if it is. It's not on there either. Oh. Sorry, we're going to have to go over to them then. Bye. Alright, Christine, since they didn't get anything. You only have one chance to steal all of their points. Um, what is the worst place to be caught naked? I'm going to have to say the changing room. Changing room? <laughs> well, let's see if that's on the board, too. No, I'm sorry, but that's not on the board either. And then cut. Okay, since none of you guys get anything, at least we finally get to see uh, where the average UCI student wouldn't be caught dead naked. Andrew, can you show us the results?
Okay, um, it's time for the second face off. I'm gonna lead Aaron and Donna. Get up here. Survey to 100 UCI students, buzzing first for them to answer. Name a vegetable that you put in a smoothie. Donna. Carrot. Let's see if it's on the board. No, sorry. It's not on the board. Aaron? Your project. Show, show me your vagina. Okay, Crystal, the question is, what vegetable do you put in? Penis! Show me penis. What? No! <laughs> Alright, Lee Green, you know the question. What vegetable would you put into a smoothie? Balls. You said balls? See if it's on the board. No. Wait, she. What vegetable would you want to put in a smoothie? Um, I'd have to say fuck. Clay, she says that she would want fuck in her smoothie. Is that on the board? What? Yes. Aaron, what vegetable do you put into a smoothie? Lesbians. There's lesbians on the board. What? And finally, Crystal, and it all hangs on you. What vegetable would you want to put into a smoothie? I'm going to have to go with she said tits. Well, since you guys won all the points, you'll be moving on to face-off round. I gotta just... I want you to go over here. This is a fast money round. You have 20 seconds to answer five questions. Try to pick the most popular answer. If you don't know what the answer is, just say pass and we'll get back to it if we have enough time. Put 20 seconds on the clock and name a famous scientist. Penis. A profession where people wear their uniform outside of work. But. The worst time to have a class. Gay. The most dangerous way to travel. Fart. And a famous dictator. Nipple. Okay, Aaron, let's see how you did. For the first question, name a famous scientist. You said penis. Survey said. All right, now for the next question a profession where people wear their uniform outside of work. You said, but, survey said, the worst time to have a class. You said gay. Let's see what the survey said. The most dangerous way to travel. You said fart. Let's see what the survey said.
and for name of famous dictator, you said nipple of the King Dynasty. Let's see what the survey said for that. All right, Aaron, you got 102 points. Your friend Clay, she needs to only get 98 points for you to win the whole thing. So let's bring out Clay, she. Okay, Clay, she get up here. Don't look at the board. Now your teammate Aaron got 102 points. You only need 98 for you and your sorority to win the $500. Now you know the rules. I'm going to ask you the same five questions I asked Aaron. If you get the same answer that she did, I'll say no, try again. Try to give the best answer. If you can't think of anything, just say pass, and we'll go back to it if we have enough time. Let's put 20 seconds on the clock, and name a famous scientist. Penis. Try again. Vagina. A profession where people wear their uniform outside of work. Penis. The worst time to have a class. Penis. The most dangerous way to travel. Penis. Name a famous dictator. Penis. Okay, let's see how you did. All right, Clayshi, I asked you the question, name a famous scientist, and you said, vagina. Survey said, all right, for a profession where people wear the uniform outside of work, you said, Penis. For worst time to have a class, you said penis. Let's see what the survey said. The most dangerous way to travel, you said penis. Let's see what the survey said. And for name a famous scientist, you said penis. Let's see if that's the number one answer. What, really? What, what's the number one answer? Hitler. Yeah, well, that's it, everybody. See you next time. So I don't win any